Hello everyone, my name is Tom Roberts and I'm from the UCL Centre for Advanced Biomedical Imaging. I'm Yannan from UCL Centre for Advanced Biomedical Imaging. And today I'm going to talk to you about the assessment of diastolic function in mouse hearts using high temporal resolution retrospectively gated cine MRI versus ultrasound. Amide proton transfer imaging. It's an emerging MRI technique. That I'm going to start off and talk to you about my introduction names. So I was uh, developing a paradigm for the assessment of diastolic function, which may be a more sensitive early indicator of heart failure than conventional. Proteins are found in protein molecules, which are shown in black. We can selectively knock off the MR signals from these amide protons. These protons can then exchange with the surrounding water protons and get transferred into water molecules. Uh, then I did a reproducibility study where I scanned a load of mice with MRI and ultrasound and there were two trials run for each, each, each modality and then I did an infarct study in a load of This therapy can destroy cancer cells by accumulating a huge amount of cellular protein which then eventually, boom, cause the cell to burst and die. MRI appears to be more sensitive than ultrasound in detecting heart failure based on assessment of diastolic function, so that's it. Thank you so much for listening and I shall look forward to meeting you at my poster stand. That's poster number nine. Thank you very much.